Hey, 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 boomers, 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 and the people who love them. It is Monificent Monday, and today I got another wonderful, wonderful tip for you when it comes to all things wine. I'm talking vino. I'm not showing any labels, but you know the bottles. And listen, if you're like me, and you try to open it, I'm fine with the twist off, but the dang corkscrew, this thing, it goes in sideways sometimes, or it doesn't go in all the way, it breaks the cork. Yuck, I gotta strain my wine, who wants to do that? And then we've got this, you need a degree in physics to make this work. It looks great when the maitre d' or the sommelier does it, but I can't do nothing with this thing. I even have it in different colors, because you know, you go on vacay, get to the cabin, and they never have a wine opener, even though they say they'll have everything you need. I need a wine opener, okay? So if you're stocking the cabin, okay, I digress. And listen, for those of you who squirrel, squirrel, yes, I have a little placard on my gas stove because I don't cook. And it seemed like just a waste of space not to use it for decorating purposes. So there, get over it. What we're talking about today is a fast, quick way to open up a bottle of wine that doesn't involve a lot of muscle and a lot of time. This is Cork Pops Wine Opener. It is lovely. I never recommend anything I don't use. And I mean, I haven't used it for a while. I have used it for a while, not have I mean, I've used it for a while, and that's why you don't see me unboxing stuff, because I don't want to see something you just got, and you're telling me how great it is. Have you used it? Has it held up to the test of time? And indeed, my pork pops has. It comes with two refills of the CO2. This is what makes the magic, so that I can easily pierce the cork, with this and it's got a cover to keep it safe and a really nice case to keep it in and it has a built-in um, foil cover but I would not use that this needle is sturdy enough but I wouldn't take the chance on twisting it so when I'm getting ready to open a bottle of wine got my foil cutter boop 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 no need to do this with a knife or scissors let's try that with a little more force turn 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 Bingo, it's ready to go. And then I take my cork pops and just go right through. And I lift weights, but I'm not like crazy strong. In fact, I got it in there a little crooked, but that's okay because I'm gonna press down on the CO2. And because it's glass and it's already full, this bottle can only hold so much. So when I do that, Ooh, baby, <laughs> that's what I'm talking about. It's nine o'clock somewhere. No, I don't day drink, but it's nine o'clock somewhere, right? Pull off the cart. Mmm, delightful bouquet. And I have used this for about six months. I don't, you know, drink excessively. You might need a lot more refills, but you can get those easily on Amazon and then I'm gonna add to it, it's not just that, but do you get headaches? Particularly when you're drinking domestic wine because there's some stuff in there, sulfites and things. Get you some drop, a couple of drops of that. I haven't had a headache in quite some time. And then, yes, you should open your red about an hour before your guests come. Let it get to the right temperature, let it air red. Time for that, you know, you had a bad day, or you're in the middle of a bad day. Sometimes you just need a drink at lunch, depending on what you do. Not in my job, I would never do that, but you know, people do think day drinking is officially recognized all around the world now. But here's how we're gonna aerate, aerate this puppy. Ooh, just infuse it with water, with air, not water. I don't want that water, I'm gonna water down wine. My goodness, and there you go clean up your mess right away so if you want an easy wine bottle opener go for the cork pops they do have a fancier version that costs a few more dollars it's got some legs and a magnet and a bunch of stuff I don't personally 
need or see any reason to pay more money for. But the overall line of products, I think is really sweet. So if this is your first time joining me, boomers and the people who love them, you intellectual tourists who like to have fun, boomer style, which means I don't want to move too much, then tune in every Monday for another edition of Monificent Monday where I've got tips, tools, movies, new uses of old products to help you live better, more efficient, more fun lives. I'm Dr. Mo Anderson. Thanks for joining me. I'll see you next Monday. Thank you.